friends. Okay, I've had a couple requests, um, including as recently as yesterday, on how to present um, a nice final bow in a showcase setting. So if you're performing like and competitively, you just do a final bow to one wall and walk off. I'll talk about how to do that in a different video. Um, but for today, we're going to talk about how to do a group bow for showcase purposes. Um, so I have a, um, a group of students who are going to do a show um, in a few weeks where they do a mock comp round and do a final bow. So um, I'll show you individually what we do as lead and follow, and then um, we'll show you as a group what that's going to look like so you know where to take your um, final bows from because the show is not over until you're done bowing and you walk off that floor and your butt's off the floor. There's nothing worse than seeing this beautiful dance and then we just, we're done. Um, so, um, as lead, usually I have the lady when I walk on or off, doesn't matter, I'm on this side. Um, so, I'll show what that looks like. When I walk onto the floor, and make sure this arm isn't swinging, but we're toned. And I'm going to place my lady wherever I want her, and I will walk away and do my call up. What I, sometimes I see that's very off putting when they place their lady, they're like just shoving her, or even worse, like pointing at her like a dog. So you got to place her, and then you walk away. For your follow -up. And then when we finish our rollout, um, if you're in the middle of dances, just roll out to your nearest audience wall. She can roll out this way or that way, doesn't matter, but she'll roll out as lead. I'm on the inside edge of my trailing leg. I am presenting her. So I'm not like me. She's the superstar. Um, so I'm going to be out to her. I have my free hand down, I have my palm up to my girl, and then we'll walk to the next position or walk off the floor if it's your final dance quick step. Um, and then if I am the lady, if I can have a male model, that'll work. So as lady, we have a slow arm when we walk out onto the floor, and a slow arm down. He'll place me, just for here, we'll place down because we're kind of in a hurry. And I'll wait for my call-up. And leads, if there's something funky or not feeling it, someone's in your way, come get your girl and walk her somewhere else. Don't be like, okay. Um, and then we'll pretend we just did our final roll-up. I'll go into how to do this, ladies, in a separate video. But we're rolling, 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 slow arms. Ladies, please don't do the ballet curtsy thing. We always want to keep this up. So you can bow with the legs. We don't want to bow, like a bow certainly for submissive, okay? It's a little different than ballet. And then I'm going to wait for him to come collect me. And if you're on, on the wrong hand, that's right, you can do a little switcheroo and on we go. Doesn't matter, we can switch. And we walk off the floor, and then we make sure, just like the dude, when I walk off, I'm poised, I'm not swinging, and my sternum is still forward, and off we go. Okay, next up, we're going to show how we would do that in a group performance. And we'll pretend we have multiple walls, because when we do a group show, it's usually not on a stage. We usually have multiple audiences. So in this case, we're going to have audience, 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 and that's what that will look like. So we'll have our couples come to the floor to demonstrate what that looks like. We'll pretend that we just finished dancing our final dance. We finished our final dance. And we'll do our final bow as a group. So we'll go to the center of the room. We'll hold hands. Usually I have someone in the middle leading the pack with the arms, so we're simultaneous. And we bow, and we're up, and then we'll turn, hold hands, 
detail on the details of how we walk out and roll up because that's really important. And you want to finish the whole thing really professionally. You don't want to look like amateur hour walking hour on. So hope that's been helpful. Thanks for your questions.